Yes, who's got another guide for you? Yo, what's going on guys? It's me, Movie, and I'm here once again with another easy game to complete, and this time I'm helping you get another 4,000 gamer score. This magical game we're playing is called My Mate. It's from the Zatylon team, so we played a few of their games, and they're not shy in putting a lot of gamer score in their games. Just so you know, this game is a platformer. We take control of this little lad here, and we have to go save Mate. I don't know, like, honestly, I don't know. I know I'm pronouncing that wrong, but um, <laughs> let's just roll with it. The female character is called Mate, and we have to go get her and bring her back to Earth. Sounds easy enough, but some of the platforming is a little bit annoying. So that's where I come in and I'm going to show you guys exactly how to do the levels and the easiest way to get the achievements. Now, before we start, I want to thank you guys so much. Uh, I hit 3000 subscribers on my birthday, which is 31st of January. Uh, thank you so much to everyone that's jumped aboard and everyone that watches my videos. As always, uh, come follow me on my Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, uh, TikTok, all of the stuff really. Um, just type in Mr. Movie, Movie, I will pop up somewhere. But yeah, come check me out on my other platforms. But enough of me going on and rambling and waffling and all that jazz. Let's go get them achievements. So this game, there is 50 levels in total, but don't you worry to get the 4,000 gamer score, we only need to do 25 of them. As we start up, we're gonna jump into level one and it's really easy. There are three buttons in this game, left, right, and A. So it's walk left, walk right, and jump. So this is what the game looks like. It's very reminiscent of, you know, a Synchro Hedgehog. Uh, what's the other one? Uh, the Butterfly one. Uh, <laughs> same old stuff, really. So we're going to use the spring, jump over, make sure you gap these easily enough. We pick up our princess and we take her back to Earth. Easy as that, and we've got our first achievement. Okay, for this second one, we're going to use the first spring to get onto the cloud, gap the hole, and then make our way over to the princess. Easy as that really, this one doesn't really need explaining, but just in case, pick her up and then make your way back. Don't you worry, there. I'm not just gonna be waffling on the whole time, I will leave you to watch my guide. There are some bits where I'm gonna pop up and let you know there's some tricky platforming ahead, so don't you worry. Okay, so now for the first of the pain in the butt levels. As we're making our way up to these clouds here to secure our princess, uh, this gap is quite tricky as you bump your head on the clouds. So you have to get right on the edge of the clouds to make the jump or you'll bounce your head off the ceiling and die. So take your time. You don't have to play as fast as I'm playing now. You can edge your way onto the ledge and then jump. Then once you've got your princess, uh, make sure you edge your way to the corner again. And then it's an easy walk back to earth. This one couldn't be any more simple. Have a little bounce on the balloons, grab your princess and bounce on back. And just like that, we've got another achievement. This one is also super easy. You just got to make your way across the rings and the balloons to grab your princess. Uh, if you don't think you're going to make the jump, don't you worry. If you hit the balloons on the side, it will kind of push you up on top of it. So don't worry if you think you can't make it. As long as you touch that balloon, it will probably grab you in and let you bounce on it. Mm -hmm. 
now we've got to contend with portals. So jump into the blue one and it will take you to the first orange one. Then jump into the second blue one and it will take you over to your princess. Now make your way back the opposite way. And ta-da, we've got level 11 achievement. Level 12 is very easy. Just make your way through the portals just like I'm doing now. But once we get to our princess, make sure you stand where I am and jump to the right corner of the box. So that way it will throw us onto the balloon. And the same with the second orange portal. Make sure you jump from the right hand side of it. So we jump on the balloon that's next to earth. Level 14 has another tricky jump. So what we're going to do, we're going to use this spring to get onto the balloon and then jump into the portal from the right hand side. And then as we land on the second balloon on the right hand of the screen, we have to make sure we're at the edge of the balloon before we make the jump or we will not make it. Same goes for once we pick the princess up and we're on our way back. Make sure you're on the edge of the cloud. Okay, for this next one, we have to do a little bit of timing. So as you can see, this cloud moving here, we have to make sure we time it right so we can land on it. Pretty much it stops on either end of the arrows. So as soon as it's getting close, start to make the jump. On the other side, use the balloon to your advantage and just wait for it to come over to you. And ta-da, we've got our next achievement. For this one, it's not as it seems. Do not jump into the blue portal as you'll kill yourself. So what we're going to do is make our way back up to this cloud here. Once we get on top of it, uh, I kind of messed it up there. Ignore that. There we go. On the cloud, we're going to make all the way over to the top right-hand side. And now there's more timing involved. We're going to jump through the portal from above. And we've got to land back on that original cloud. It might take a couple of attempts, but I believe in you. So this one is a little bit tricky. What we're going to do is make our way all the way over to the right hand side into the blue portal. It will drop us on the princess's head and now we'll make our way over the balloons onto the orange portal. But you have to time it right as you're going to come through that first blue portal just above to the left. So you have to land on the moving cloud or you're going to land on them spikes. If you manage it, you get your next achievement. This one isn't really hard. There's a little tricky knack at the end that you have to do. Uh, to grab the princess, you have to kind of jump off the balloon and kind of hit her to the side. It's the same sort of thing we were doing with the balloons in the earlier level. If you hit her to the side, you'll probably get her. But easy as that. Okay, I'm not going to lie to you guys. This one is quite tricky. We're going to have to land on the moving cloud just ahead of us and jump onto the spiky square. Then we're going to have to jump onto the cloud once again when it gets to the other side. Now from there we have to quickly jump onto the balloon but don't go too far into the balloon or you'll headbutt the spikes above you there. From this balloon we need to make our way over to the second moving cloud but don't go too far to the right of that or you'll get catapulted off. Make your way up to the princess and then it's the gruelling task of doing that all over again. This one took me a fair few attempts but don't you worry I believe in you and as you can see I didn't even land on the earth I just grazed it and got the win. Okay, follow what I'm about to do on the screen now and try this out a couple of times. Go from the top balloon to the bottom balloon as that's what we're going to need to do to win this level. Make our way over like I'm doing now and slide down to grab the princess. Jump into the portal and then we make our way back over to the balloons. And now we have to get on the lower level of balloons to get under the spikes. This is a little bit tricky and it made me sweat quite a bit. Um, so take your time with it. Get to the edge of the balloon and give it the old wrap around and then we're underneath. And just like that, we've got level 23. Now there's two more levels to go. This one is really easy. Um, it's pretty much very straightforward. Get over to the other side of the princess. But as you catapult yourself up to grab her, make sure you don't headbutt the spikes like I do there. So we're going to make our way over. 
And we're pretty much just gonna like aim ourselves into the left hand side of the balloon we jump on. And we should go in between the spikes just like that. Once you've got the princess, use the second balloon to get on this plinth here, and then we'll jump to safety to the balloons, then make our way back to Earth. Now, one more level and we're all done. As you can see, it's not going to be easy for us because these are really pain in the butt jumps. But once you've mastered it, it is quite simple. This game isn't going to let you get that last achievement really easily. It's going to take you a few attempts, as you can see, just like I'm doing now. The trick is to get right to the edge. But the only thing is, if you get too close to that edge, that spike is going to kill you. Um, same thing with the balloons. Um, don't try to hit all of them. Just make your way over to the platform as best you can. And when you're on the balloons and on the clouds, just try and edge yourself to the corner as much as possible before leaving the platform. As you can see, I took my time here as I was getting quite frustrated. Oh, he nearly killed himself. Oh, oh, oh okay, I did kill myself. Here's the actual run of me doing it. Easy peasy, make my way over there. On your way over, you can master it quite easily. Um, but on your way back, I would take it very slowly. As, as you can see, I got to the last jump and killed myself. So you don't want to be uh, pulling your hair out. But just like that, we did it, and boom, there is our last achievement. And now we're the new owners of another 4,000 gamer score. If you've been playing along and getting them achievements from my guide, congratulations. And that is the end of my guide. Thank you so much for watching. If I helped you out in any way, please let me know in the comments section. And if you want to see more of my guides, hit that subscribe button. But until next time, I have been Mulvey, and I'll see you later. Happy hunting.